I love people. I want to get to show you how to create uh, yeah, engraved shapes because you can use sculpt and brush to create uh, fantastic shapes like uh, this placement map similar to this place and this is called engraving. I have to check in on the dictionary. I have to check if I if my English is correct because uh, I can't go tell you in English, this is what I meant, uh, engrave, and okay, okay, I will show you how to do that, because I have learned uh, video tutorial, from video tutorial how to do that properly, to preserve uh, details. Okay, I, we have a polygon object. We have to have a multi-resolution modifier. Like okay, I will show you scan my scan. I subdivide the polygon as you see like that to preserve sharp corners. Okay, I will move a little bit. This is very important before you apply multi-resolution. Wait a minute. Why this doesn't work? Oh, I just didn't see. Because I did not get this select this. I need a value up to uh, 8. It all depends what type of computer are you using. If you have lots of memory, that's fine. If you have very powerful, very powerful processor uh, CPU, this will handle your polygon. Uh, also, the graphics card, because after when you engrave objects, shapes into polygon, you can uh, make normal map. But at the moment, I want to show you step by step what steps you are supposed to do. When you go to Sculpt Brush, you choose Draw Sharp. Then we have to choose Stroke Drag Dot. The only thing is, I cannot change from Circle. I wish I could do that, but. Uh, you can change radius. If you want to get rid of map, map I will choose default, map I will show you. You, uh, you click, you hit new, you click on that. You can load the map, because uh, this uh, will support a PNG format and TIFF format. Uh, we will choose uh, this image at the moment, first. Also keep in mind what uh, settings you apply, because we have got subtract, this is like we go other way around, uh, it should be in front, and it will be on the other side. Wait a minute, how does this look like? Oh, this looks a little bit different. Ah, this is like inward. Oh, oh, this actually looks cool. Uh, normal radius. I will check higher value. I think, I think this is to do with extrusion. Uh, I, w was I correct? I think so. Auto smooth with uh, smoothing polygons. Oh, I forgot to mention sculpt plane, area plane. 
Uh, map ink area lane and very organic. Uh, don't forget about follow. If you scroll stank, your texture will be visible. It's more may not be as visible as when you choose clone skank. Sphere. Sphere is also okay, but uh, wait a minute. No, choose the clone skank. Clone skank will be the best for such textures. Because you will have uh, visible edges. Uh, this may not look uh, correct. Now it's looking almost perfect. It is looking almost perfect. But the best texture, uh, people, one of my favorite texture is this one. You can also rotate texture, texture when you uh, wake a minute. I think I will go in orthographic viewwork. Contrary F, you can rotate texture. We have beautiful texture of the bag uh, or cushion or whatever. You can later on and make to normal map. But that texture, I think, wasn't high resolution texture. Where I was. Oh, this texture will be perfect. But I have to zoom in. Oh, I will definitely use this texture. Because I want to see uh, how good that texture will be. But you have to rename extension of the file. Oh, this is perfect. Hopefully this is what I was looking for. Uh, okay. So far, uh, alpha. Uh, I have to double check if I am correct. But as you can see, we have white and black colors. At least no errors came up. Okay, we have to get rid of this. We open up. Uh, I'm hoping so that it will get me what I was looking for. Ah, uh, hmm. I I have mixed uh, feelings. Well, now it's well, now it is looking um, fairly good, but not what I was expecting. Auto smooth, normal radius. Oh, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. But uh, I check uh, details. You can still make normal map, and hopefully this will be okay. This looks okay. But I can say it is perfect. I like very much uh, that texture, but I will open up uh, another one. That one is quite good. I haven't checked that texture. We have to decrease value, because our value, uh, this strength of the brush. I think, oh, this is, oh, nice, I like shape, but I, I still have to change settings. I think that one should be okay, it should be okay. 
it definitely looks like there. I have used the different texture. Uh, this could be perfect when you work with uh, decoration inside the house. So you can use uh, this as normal map. I didn't publish the tutorial how to create normal map. Um, not yet, not at the moment. Oh, this the I didn't uh, open up. Uh, wait a minute. I didn't use a cycle yet. I could add uh, light to check uh, how this looks in real time. So. Oh, yes, yes, this is actually visible. Wonderful, this is what I was looking for. You can see people details, but at the same time, uh, unfortunately, this affects my performance and hurting gigs of RAM have has been used uh, like once you make normal map it should be okay but I don't like too many details the best the best shape which I like I cannot uh, I cannot uh, I can do nothing at the moment but I'm happy because I can get rid of multi resolution uh, at least I could get rid of multi resolution modifier. To use another texture. I like very much that texture. This is one of my favorite. But because we decreased the value, it's almost invisible shape. Normal radius. Oh, definitely better. But change the strength of the brush, at least for that value. Now it looks definitely better, and it all depends how many polygons you have. But once you use normal map, it should be okay. Uh, I will I will stick with eight value because this gives the best results. Uh, it's not perfect. Oh, definitely vector when I look at it. But when I switched uh, to polygon from scalp, polygon decreased value. Aha, okay. I understand. Oh, now it's back there. I forgot to change level view art. Okay, that's it. I hope you like my video tutorials.